Howdy everybody, it's White Tiger coming at you, and uh, I just wanted to make a quick little video giving you an update about what's going on. Um, the reason being uh, is because <laughs> I've already gotten to where I wanted to get to, but i just been sitting here waiting to do the video. Um, so you can see all these things here. Actually, let me just back up and do this, take all my gear off. Um, I'm probably going to finish the video later on, but uh, just for right now, I just wanted to give a heads up as to what I've been up to while I've been off camera. Looky there. Quantum suit. Ha <laughs> ha. All of the pieces. The leggings and the boots. Yeah. I've been waiting all weekend to do this, because I think I did this all on Friday. High tech wonder, yes. It's a wonder. <laughs> But anyways, I wanted to give you an update about um, what other machines I've been making and everything else. And what the f <laughs> I look like the men in black. Are you serious? Really? Oh, man. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not so bad. It's just uh, it's not what I was expecting. I was expecting to look, you know, like a white suit of armor or something like that. I mean, nothing bad against this. I mean, this looks pimp, but... It's just not what I was expecting, so but it's okay, no worries. Anyway, so uh, I went over here, and made a crucible and fluid transposer. I'm start making test racks and stuff, because dimensional transceivers from Ender IO is just whew, way too costly and expensive. There's my old diamond armor, and for the OCDers, <laughs> upside down sword, upside down jetpack. <laughs> uh, let's see, uh, made a metal former over here. Uh, just to try to get some of the pieces for the quantum pseudo armor and uh, went and upgraded my MFE might as well just go ahead and chuck this stuff in there right quick what? no 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 are you serious? so I gotta go to MFSU to charge this crap now? hell if I would have known that I would have dang so I went through and made all these uh, oh I forget what this is a power conversion mod uh, uh, anyways, this is the HV uh, producer. That's RF consumer. See, see, I got the power going straight into the consumer, and this is the bridge that you have to build in order to be able to get everything. And this one's a low-level uh, EU producer, so that way all these machines can run. I can just get rid of this generator. And then this thing here is a implosion compressor with a multi-block structure behind it. And this is this was needed to make some of the iridium plates or something like that with industrial TNT. And this thing back here, if you're wondering, is a molecular transformer. Molecular blah, 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 blah. molecular transformer, which I thought was really cool at one time because I've seen people uh, have these things before and they can make diamonds and stuff like that. But on this one. No, Feed the Beast just decided to say, nope, nope, all you're going to be able to make is Scenarium, and that's it. So, yeah, what a waste. I mean, I'm going to have to make Scenarium eventually later on, but for right now, what a waste. And this is insulated gold cable, and I guess this stuff isn't blowing up yet, because I was reading up. I could, for some reason, this, there was a, that red arrow that's over there, it wasn't filling up, so I thought I needed more pumped in I thought the mod had changed but now you just only need 32 EU per tick so I wouldn't recommend having this set up because uh, if IC2 was enabled where you know explosions were available yeah this thing would have done exploded half my base by now and uh, the only other thing I've changed really uh, just made this little underground area I plan to expand it and all the way out here. See, that's it. Oh man, this rain. Oh, wow. Okay, so I can run faster now, but I can't. I still can't fly. I, just, I ain't got my jetpack. I ain't got the jetpack attached or whatever. Man, I'm so disappointed. Now I gotta go make a daggum. Whoa, god, dog. Now that was cool. Now, if only I had jetpack on here, that'd be great. Oh, 
and one other thing. <laughs> I messed about and got a whole crap ton of photovoltaic cells and one little redstone solar panel because I was trying to make a solar panel for the EU side and I made the wrong one obviously so I made the RF version instead so I just stopped at the redstone solar panel and was like add ah, to heck with it and uh, threw in much more vibrant capacitor banks but uh Oh yeah, uh, one other thing I wanted to show right quick, it's not too much of a big deal, but uh, apparently there's some things left in here. Uh, you can make vibrant turbine rotors, so that way you can make your own vibrant alloys instead of having to get a whole bunch of nuggets and putting them in and making them like that. Uh, what else? There was a, capac a, a bank, vibrant, what, what happened? Well, anyways, there's the capacitor bank, and then you're supposed to have a vibrant capacitor bank, but... Capa um, hey, it disappeared. I made a whole bunch of capacitor banks, the vibrant ones, but now they're gone. Uh, we didn't update, as far as I know, so... That's weird. That's really weird. Now I'm gonna have to yank one of these suckers out and see if I can't relearn it. I don't know. But anyways, I just wanted to give a quick update. I'll probably continue this video later on. But, uh, until then, me and my pimp outfit. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to get the, uh, jetpack add-on to this. But, I mean, that's, the suit's not too bad. It's real pimp looking. I like the sunglasses. That's pretty cool. Except you can see my eyes underneath the sunglasses. <laughs> But anyways, I'll uh, holler at y'all in a little bit, hopefully. Well, for me, it'll be maybe a day or so, but for you guys, hopefully it won't be too terribly long. So, see you in a little while. Peace. Alright, I'm finally back. It was actually a few days for me, but hopefully a few seconds for you guys. Um, <clears throat> anyways, I want to get back to what I was uh, trying to show you beforehand, but I've done actually a little bit more work as you can see with the little machine beside me but uh... first of all i gotta apologize i gotta turn down my render distance usually i have it on far but uh... i have to turn it down in order for y'all not to be able to see uh... what Travis is working on because it's actually really cool the house he's working well shoot i gave it away dagnabbit but anyways my bad so yeah uh, anyways going on to the next thing in order to make tesseracts I had these fluid transposers installed in the magma crucible to grind down the enderpearls or liquefy them or whatever special chests full of enderpearls and hopper uh, alloy smelter to smelt up the oh, quartz uh, nether quartz to make uh, nether infused uh, glass and then this stuff here I was making in the enderium and hopefully y'all could see my mouse cursor now because I've been trying to work on fixing things uh, over here is my auto brewer where I've been making water breathing because I've been wanting to try to get underground but I just really need a core I just I don't know why I just haven't gotten to it a uh, bunch of blaze rods I've stolen from Travis's farm oh <sighs> need to hurry up and sleep because right now I'm being completely powered whoops oh by the way uh, in case you were wondering the reason why I had my top off uh, <laughs> so to speak is because I went and had made the ultimate solar helmet as you can see in the gravity chest plate and all the you know, quantum suit stuff so I think I showed that in the previous uh, video that I had the little pimp outfit <laughs> Um, in this video, when I'm saying previous video, but, oh, well, anyways, yeah, no fall damage, just gravy. Activate the engine, I have basically created a flight. But, yeah, my little solar panel farm, <laughs> I'm actually kind of proud of it. Uh, <clears throat> I went and made five of these quantum solar panels as well. Uh, they don't generate as much as I thought they would, but... Anyways, I got the glass fibre cable. That's what I call it, fibre. It, <laughs> I know it's fiber, but it just looks like fibre. Glass fibre cable. And 
I'm trying to expand on the base a little bit, but I've been doing some other stuff. I like finally got rich in resources thanks to Trias's Blaze Farm and EMC uh, equivalent exchange and all that stuff. Uh, I've just been doing it up, as you can see. Uh, let's see what else has changed. Uh, try to compress my stuff into a chest. It's all basic blah stuff. And other blah, IC2, Ender IO, uh, different things. Just random things. Oh, hurry up, son. I'm really impatient about this son now because I'm running this. Uh, that's what I was getting to, anyways. But yeah, I uh, also got lava going down here. Uh, let me show you. Big old tank, but it's not even full. It looks like it's full, or it's got something in it, but it's actually no, no millibuckets, no buckets, no nothing in there right now because I'm running slow on one magma crucible, melting down cobblestone into lava and just get sucked right up by the geothermal energy. Uh, well, that's the regular generator in case I need to kickstart stuff, but it's, this is sucking it up, and it don't look like it's doing anything, but it really is. It's powering a whole bunch of this other stuff. I got Metal Former, uh, of course, she's never really seen the extractor before, but Metal Former, you can, you know, basically make wires, uh, make cans and uh, plates and different things like that, and cut things, uh, uh, it works, trust me. Oh, and uh, uh, the wall of OCDers. <laughs> I had to put this up because uh, <laughs> I love this fact. It's uh, Trials always comes in here into my base and right sides up everything. You know, it just changes around to the way it normally is supposed to look. Like so. But I just like messing with people, so. <laughs> Actually, I could just really throw things off. Yeah, that don't look right. Whatever. Just, whatever, whatever. I don't want that sword to be upside down, though. Yeah. Okay, I'm facing that way, that way. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> uh, sure, why not? Alright. But anyways, uh, I, come, I keep skipping over power converters. I'm just so excited that I've gotten all this stuff, so. Anyways, yeah, power converter, I got a low level low voltage power converter right here to hook up, well, the, actually, yeah, the connect generator because I had to put a motor in here to make this turning table to make my laser, the mining laser, this is awesome. <laughs> Let me go run and show you this. Oh yeah, the quantum suit lets me run like crazy. Oh, I gotta sleep before my power drains out. I think it'll, I think it'll run so, I don't know, man. Actually, you know what? I should probably just wet out through the night and just keep... <gasps> Shoot! I looked! Oh, crap! Ah, oh, crap, 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 crap. Uh, trying to gonna kick my tush. I'm gonna see if I can edit that out for once. I'm gonna actually try to do some editing. If not, then well, this whole thing was just a waste. But anyway, so... Getting back to this recycler. I have an ender chest feeding in cobblestone to the recycler, making scrap with an overclocker and an injector upgrade as you can see and mass fabricator is just chugging 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 along it's got a fluid ejector upgrade so made two resident portable tanks I don't think that will fill up anytime soon but uh, it's just chugging chugging along making some um, UU matter or, well that's what they used to call it it's UU liquid now but it is UU matter but anyways it's a liquid now and we're gonna convert things and transform things and stuff. I just the reason why I'm trying to go through tonight is I'm trying to see if I completely run out of power between day and night because I made a whole crap ton of solar panels as you saw before. Oh yeah, the top part of the base. Oh, I moved every uh, all the torches and made these lamps instead. I don't know if it's... Oh, sh God, net, bless it. Uh, dang it. Trice is really going to kill me. Uh, Freaking heck. It is such a gorgeous design, though. I just I want you to be able to see for yourselves uh, in his video. But this is a blast furnace. I should be making cold cook with. Uh, let me go grab that. Oh, and this thing here. Uh, I bet everybody was wondering what the heck this thing is. This is the Vajra. This thing is 
the bee's knees. Let me show you right quick. Oh. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> and clear this whole area out in a matter of minutes instead of taking forever. It replaces your pickaxe, uh, your shovel, and basically an axe. I mean, it'll cut wood, it'll do everything. I'm trying not to look at Tronis' new home or whatever, but I'm just trying to give a tour of what's been, what I've been up to and what's been going on, because I've never gotten this far. I just think it's awesome. <laughs> and the cocoa, but yeah. Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, I only run off this, but then I need to smell some iron. That's right. That's what I was doing earlier. I forgot. Oh, yeah. I'm, uh... Oh, I forgot to show that big machine up there, dirt. Um, this thing is the implosion compressor. You need industrial TNT to create iridium plates or something like that, but this was necessary, and yeah, I just completely skipped over it. Herp, derp, derp, derp. Um, I only made just this little small tunnel. Them Degum horses always get me. I hear them, and it freaks me out for some reason. But yeah, watch this. Boom. One hit kill. If I want to be really lazy about it, let's find some target practice. Because this thing is awesome. Oh, freaking hell. Dang it. I say I'm not going to do it and I keep doing it. Charles is going to really kick my butt. But yeah, this is from my long ranges instead of arrows. It takes a little bit longer, I think, maybe, but whatevs. I love this. I can just jump around and not be worried about being killed. <laughs> really coming a long way. Oh, yeah, this thing is mines, obviously. It says it's a mining laser, but yeah. <laughs> I'm just having way too much fun. Yeah, I finally decided to put the music back on. Uh, it's always raining. Alright, let me look this way. So I really want everybody to go see Toronto's is based on his channel. His is just absolutely gorgeous. Let him give you the tour and everything. These are generating 248 still, but these ain't generating shit. Oh, yeah, my nano saver. I showed y'all that in the last part of the video, I think. I'll fill that in right quick. That's... Even to me, it's annoying. But, uh, whatever. <laughs> One white block. It's just gonna. Uh, let's see. Oh, hey, you, go away. Look at that, that's awesome. One hit kill. Boom. There. Like too much crap. Alright. Now, go back inside the base and get some iron right quick. I forget. Oh golly, yeah. I'm gonna have to sleep as much as possible till I get. See, I'm planning on putting all the solar panels into the mining world, but yeah, put on test racks. Cause look, I got. I forgot about this. Look, I have freaking test racks for days, so I can transfer energy and uh, matter and everything all in all I want to. So I was gonna put all the those solar panels out there, put them all into the mining world, that green portal over there. But, uh, yeah, I'm getting too excited now. <laughs> Dang, see, look at that, it's still dropping. It's sucking out that mad power. Well, huh. MFSU always takes up a bunch of power, but as soon as that drops below, it's not going to work anymore. Shoot, dang it, I keep looking at it. I thought I had it low enough. I guess not. Ah, uh, not tiny. Short. No. Whatever. Uh, but yeah, the UD matter, the big old huge lava tank. I'll make a little bit. I saw some of it coming down. 
It's just, I gotta just make more magma crucibles. I mean, that's just nothing to it. Either that or the resident. Ooh, I can make the resident one now, because I have the. Ooh, okay. But anyways, I just had an idea. I'll just make a better magma crucible. But yeah, uh. I guess that's about it. I just wanted to give everybody an update of what's been going on with me. And just kind of continue this video and uh, pull it to the close. But. Next time I'm going to see if I go into the end and maybe not killing the Ender Dragon just yet, but just going to get some resources and stuff and try to see if I can't come back. Well, anyways, I'll hit job later. Peace, y'all. Take care. Yo, what's going on again? It's my Tiger coming at you one last time for last and final word. Uh, things have changed right quick. And this is really awesome. I just had to show this because Charles said I can just release a video of me showing his house. But he replaced all the redstone lamps with a white lamp. I mean, he's the only person I can think of that might be able to do that. So, well, I mean, you know, but I just think it's a lot better the idea than a lot I had with the redstone lamps. So I just thought that was really cool. But, uh, yeah, that's about it, I think. Uh, oh, he left this chest here. Yeah, okay. There's all my stuff. Okay, no problem. Cool. Thank you, Trionis. But, uh, I just wanted to say, uh, one last thing. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next time, then. Peace, y'all. Oh, yeah, the one thing I wanted to say, uh, I realized I had gone through the machines once already in the beginning part of this video, but, uh, I don't know. I just got so excited because I've been able to <laughs> finally get to these machines and get things kind of going and cooking up and doing things and yeah but oh yeah one other thing I wanted to show before I stop and publish the video and try to uh, also agree to allow me to yeah I already said that uh, to show this video of the house but uh, I built this as well I'm going to put jump crowd theme in there and Yellorium, and just at least have a power source for anybody that needs it or wants it or whatever. But the uh, way this thing's configured, it should be pretty stable once I get everything going, of course. But I mean, not just stable, but you know, just powerful. It generates a hell of a lot of power. And goody, blocks the seal. Excellent. More cold coke. Ah, that cramps. That thing's filled up. Oh, shoot. Oh, I'll get to that later, but... Oh, I forgot I'm recording. Whoops. <laughs> but anyways, uh... This uh, goofball white tiger <laughs> saying, hey, what's up, y'all? And to Mrs. Scoops, if you actually see this video, I did try to come to your live stream. I just didn't know when it happened, and a lot of things went down today. This is actually July 10th, um, 2016 when I'm recording this last little bit here, but anyways, I tried. And I'm sorry I didn't make it, and I apologize, but I'll hit y'all up next time. Peace out, y'all. Yeah, 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 I know, but one more final thing. Uh, thank you, Trionis, for replacing all these lamps in here. It's a lot better than having switches on all of them and everything, so this is a great idea. And uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, thank you so much. All right. Now, for real. Peace. For real. Honestly. Not for real. <laughs> Not for real. For real, for real.